It's national meets regional. It's Sidewalks Entertainment. The long running celebrity. Music. And art series. Join us for a new path to arts and entertainment. Compared to other actresses, um, you kind of lay low and under the radar and hang back a little bit. So was it challenging to play this wild and extroverted character of Mary Lou? Yeah, I am. Um, <clears throat> I would have done anything on this movie. I would have done craft service. Mm -hmm. I would have catered. I would have fed everyone or done nothing and just been a fan and like driven around. Um, I, I think uh, it's it's crazy to, to accept a role that you don't think that you can do, but when I accepted this part, there was no part of me that thought that I could do her justice. Yeah. And I was just like, I can't say no. And, uh, you know, she, I think getting to know the woman behind the character as well, it's, it was a little bit easier to not play a caricature. She wasn't mm -hmm. just wild and sexy. Yeah. And, um, she really was a formidable partner. She really never was taken from, she was always giving and really getting so much back in return and uh, to play somebody, especially a teenager, because um, I, I was a little bit older than her. Mm -hmm. um, I think I was a younger teenager, I think I was just a younger version of, 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 a, of a woman. I think um, to be so self-aware and so unselfconscious is not a teenage attribute. It's mm -hmm. just not, it's not, it's almost impossible and she had it just so easy and yeah. she was a bottomless pit of like empathy I think um, to let her face hang out and just be so sort of open and like really in love with the lives of her friends and not wanting to, to pri deprive them of any of that life is um, it's amazing it's why the book is so incredible and um, it was hard but I think I had to f I, it, in order to do her justice and not let that down mm -hmm. I would have done absolutely anything. anything and you did a really good job Thanks. I really enjoyed it. Thanks. Um, does this this project was in the works for so long, like a couple of years. Does it feel, how good does it feel that it's finally out and you get to share something mm. that's, that's different than Twilight? Feels good. Yeah. Um, yeah, I, it's funny, I, I, never felt I never felt stuck. I, I, um, I feel the exact same way about Breaking Dawn 2 coming out recently. Mm. It's like, finally, the story is out. I'm, my responsibility, you know, that, that pressure if over a five year period is crazy. This actually was the same way. I, we, I knew that I was going to do this movie when I was freshly 17, yeah. possibly still 16. And um, so it's, it's definitely the same feeling. It's, uh, and, and then more so than that, people have been waiting for this movie to be made for literally decades. Right. Um, yeah, it's amazing. I mean, it's like, it's so, it's so rare to be able to share what you love with literally millions of people. Mm -hmm. And it's flammable. It suddenly it makes it more for you. It's like you look over your shoulder and you see someone loving something that you love, and you can do you can do it more. Do you know yeah. what I mean? So we're hanging out in beautiful San Francisco right now, and it's a pretty important setting in the film. Um, I don't know if you have time today, but do you plan to kind of check out a little bit of the beat tour while you're here? I cannot believe that I'm here for the first time in my life and mm -hmm. having to leave at 1.30 in the afternoon. Oh, <laughs> it's so quick. I know, it's like, it's actually kind of painful because we, uh, there were three days on the shoot that they came here with my character. Um, my, my, uh, my character has a, she's a real person mm -hmm. and her daughter uh, spoke to us at length about her life and her relationship with her and she actually, I was unavailable for those three days and she played me. She oh, actually nice. sat in the back of the car and uh -huh. drove around San Francisco. And oh, that's awesome. So I've been deprived of the experience, but that's okay because it's like the coolest thing ever. So well, congratulations on the film. Awesome. I really Thanks. enjoyed it. <laughs> we have an interview with Kristen's co-star from On the Road, Garrett Hutland, on our website at SidewalksTV.com. After watching today's episode, don't forget to visit Sidewalks on Facebook and Twitter. Facebook.com slash Sidewalks TV Show. Twitter.com slash Sidewalks TV.